done our day in studio or at least for the next three-ish hours and then I have lunch plans with friends and then a book launch event later in the evening that is the plan I wonder how some people are able to paint so fast. Like, can you tell me your secret? <laughs> I wanna know. I wanna know how to paint fast. into the complex realms of intimacy, queerness, unrequited love, mental health, and geography. Described by the artist himself as a muted tantrum. I would be like alone in the street or like be in, um, like walking down an avenue or whatever, and then I'll write down these thoughts and emotions. <laughs> Good morning. I slept at 2 in the morning last night. I spent an hour and a half editing a thumbnail, which I don't know why I did that to myself. But I am up and that is all that matters. I still need to get some work done, eat breakfast, get ready because I'm going hiking with my friends later. Perfect timing because I do need to wash my hair. It's getting oily. Let's get out of bed first. <laughs> <laughs> Where are we going? Because last time I came, there were people on the rock, like having a picnic. <laughs> Oh my god, 
I am bleeding. Pottery makes your skin so dry and I did not even notice. Anyways, good afternoon. I am in the studio today. I just made three mugs and I have around like an hour-ish, an hour and a half before I need to leave for an event. So I'm gonna make some incense holders. I'm trying to make more of these little star incense holders. My sunlight went away. Let me let me bring you guys somewhere a little bit brighter. I've given up on wearing an apron for today because this is this is going to be my studio outfit. I feel like I set really high creative expectations for myself sometimes to the point where nothing gets done because i'm just always scared of how the outcome is so i'm trying to work on that i'm trying to create without any expectation <laughs> does that make sense i never really thought of myself as a perfectionist but i'm starting to think that i i am one every time i do anything whether it's like ceramics or painting or editing i have a mindset where i'm like okay this needs to come out perfect and if it's not i'm gonna be very sad i mean to create without expectations <laughs> that is one of my 2024 goals how did i make this hello okay <laughs> bye bye general shape is here clay shrinks around 12 percent depending on the clay you use so i always try to make everything way bigger than they should be because every time it comes out of the kiln the first time I tried ceramics, I did it with my friend Scarlett. I made everything super tiny. When they came out of the kiln, everything was even tinier. It was hilarious. I've also been really into rock formations lately. So I want to make pieces that look like a bunch of rocks. that i bought a change of clothes with me that way they won't get dirty when i'm working with clay so gotta get changed i'm definitely going to be cold but that is okay i'm going to a tattoo studio opening today and normally i don't go to big social gatherings because i get socially overwhelmed really easily but today i'm going to put my tattoo artist cap on This is the fit. Gotta go. Oh, can I get the small, please? I gotta clean before my friends get here. Yeah. Gonna wrap some gifts. Not too bad. <laughs> Pour a little bit of each one and then just... Yeah. Great, right? Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Turquoise. Under... Oh, okay. So this is underglaze. Yeah. Okay. 
Tiff's literally here from World What day is it today? Happy Tuesday! We had hot pot for dinner, so yummy. I made this tom yum soup base. I'm literally so full from it and kind of bloated. This morning, we are going to get some work done. I've been working on some digital art. Well, that's a lie. It's been sitting in my Procreate for like the past few months. The thing with digital art is that I always want to just keep zooming in and working on really tiny details but then once i zoom out i can barely see like what i just did i'm gonna work on this for a bit and then i need to head into studio to trim some mugs but also another part of me is like here's the thing the second book of divine rivals just came out and i want to just stay on the couch in bed all day to read that book but i shouldn't i really should not and I will not. <laughs> Practicing my self-control and also because I already did this last week, I spent two days at home on the couch, didn't move, and I read all three books in the Broken Earth series. That was so good. Let's do this. anywhere i just have bags and bags so many bags on me this is so hilarious you know and it worked i'm just trying to make the this color the world, go right? away mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. land of Sofa you have? Yeah. It it's recording. <laughs> <laughs> Hi guys, this is Rito. I'm back to vlogging with Jasmine's camera. Here's Stokey. It is really wide angle. Right? I like it. I like wide angle yeah. shots. So creepy right now. <laughs> it's my first metal baby. <laughs> I'm so creepy. I 
feel like it's a little bit difficult to use, honestly. <laughs> this place is so freaking cool. Maybe I'll be here after three years once my studio lease is up and I know that I have a better gist of what I'm doing with my life creatively. Just waiting for Leah to pack up her things and then we're gonna go get lunch and go visit my studio. trying to document my process and like my camera can't capture the angle. So two yeah. hours, actually two hours. <laughs> two hours. Two hours of this, I think we're doing pretty good. I made a vase. <laughs> it's very, it's very round. Mm -hmm. And I made a jewelry holder for Jasmine. Rings here, and then this. Oh, sorry, sorry. A earring, 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 and then rings here. So cute. And maybe you can put rings here too, because oh, yeah. it's stuck in the middle too. And here. Uh -huh. and here. Oh, here probably not, just here. <laughs> and she wants to make this kind of lava. -ish. Yeah, on lava the outside. outside and blue and green inside. Uh -huh. So it's gonna be lava blue green, lava blue, lava uh -huh. blue green turns. So cute.